Hi guys, it's Granny Turner speaking. Welcome to the FS22, the Valley the Old Farm. This is part 5 and we are just on harvesting or collecting the straw. But my combine wants to go home and as it is standing on the straw swath, I think I'll do it. I drive it home and it still has some grain in his in its bunker. So then we have to unload it and then we can finish the straw harvest here. There's really a lot to do on this first day, but uh, I thought so. So I, I can be really happy that I can just sleep and live in the house. It looks perfectly fine. So I don't need to do my farming and renovation of the house, but only the farming, because this is uh, enough to me. And I think later, when first things are done, then it will go smoother and every day will be not as long as this, especially in the winter time. When the fields are sleeping, only the animals are hungry. So I think with the combine I go through the main entrance. This went smoothly. I, there were nearly no cars and I could go to the side enough. This was easy. So maybe I will keep this field? Because when I sell the field I can't buy another field that is close by. That is different with the other field. For this I can buy a field that is close by. So chickens, take care. I'm coming. You have to run away and not to me. But maybe you should know I bought a specially chicken race that is more or less in indestructible. So if I happen to drive over chicken, they won't be hurt. They just jump out of underneath the, the wheel and they will be fine. So don't worry um, about the chickens. So, where can I park my combine? Maybe there. You see, the white chicken is totally fine. So this is a special, nearly un indestructible race of chickens and ducks. This is perfect here. Only too small <laughs> to um maybe I can crouch. No, I have to go a little bit to the right. Ok, 
Okay, I think now this will be better here. Yeah, much better. Okay. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is good. I could take this other track to him. So... And I need a place for this. I think I will use this very often and therefore it gets the first place. Chicken, take care. Okay. Yeah, that's it for now. And I just go back to the other tractor, which is here. And I finish my straw harvest. I mean, for keeping this field would speak that the harvest went without any problems. So the combine didn't tipped over from the slope. And there was were only a little bit of leftovers from its work. And from the money I would get from this field, I couldn't buy a different field. And the way from, from my farm to here is not so terrible. It is a little bit of a way, but could be worse. Much worse. Yeah, and what would speak for selling is it's not close enough to my farm as I would love it to be and the shape and the slope is not so much to my liking oh I have to come back in one more time so maybe the field is bigger than I thought and all the loading wagon is smaller than I hoped. Look what a huge field this is. But it has a very strong slope as well.
So maybe I'll have a look on the map and think about it money-wise another time and then I'll decide. And maybe I should consider what I want to buy else. So I want to build two production buildings, small and tiny ones. That would be 50,000 bucks already. And maybe I would buy several more gardens in this area that is uh, at the sheep bar. This is taking a lot of scroll. So there where we just look on to. And so maybe that's another ten, maybe fifteen, sixteen thousand. And then I need um, something like a plow for making the fields. I think this is not so expensive. And I can sell the existing small plow. And I would need a um, water tank. That is one of the next things I would buy. So the money is nearly spent and I would love to have maybe one cow and some cow babies also and then I would need to buy the food that would be so silly somehow but maybe even not And here they offered me um, a very practical version to have something like a buying station on my farm where I could buy all kinds of materi materials for the farm like seeds and fertilizer and even animal food. But I would have to pay for this tiny building. And then I would get free delivery of farm supply stuff. In this case, for the food for the cows. So maybe I sh could do it like that. I buy all the stuff that I want to have and I sell the other field, the canola field that is rather far away and buy the grass field that is rather close by and then I'll see what I have money wise on my on my bank account 
and then I decide on whether I want to sell this small wheat field or not. And if I keep it, I would maybe... Maybe saw barley tomorrow? I could saw canola today, but I think that would be a little bit too much for today. And it's still not completely full. Wow. Maybe I can have a look what they say here. Whether, yes, here. 39,000 liters of straw, but I don't get information um, how much percentage it is because I don't have any cows yet. So, but yeah, I shouldn't worry. Oh, and somehow I would love to have an additional tractor. Maybe this is really silly. Because right now I I'm quite happy with my both tractors. Yeah, but I think in the long run two tractors will be too little. Later I will need bigger tractors as well, but right now it would be nice to just have another small tractor, maybe. A cheap one, a really cheap one. So let's have a look here. This didn't change. So I have to look here. Small tractors. Oh, here this Porsche. But it has only 14 horsepowers. Now this is not enough. This is really cute, I guess. Let's see. Oh yeah, it's very, very cute. But 14 horsepower snow. And this has 25... It's uh, still too small somehow. Because I would like it to, to maybe tow the water trailer around on the farm when the bo uh, both of the other tractors are working in the field and yeah and maybe even use the um, uh, loading wagon and for delivering food for the chickens and so maybe something like 40 or 50 horsepowers would be okay here i have farm all from case this is up to for 50 horsepower and this up to 47 horsepower so i would go for the bigger one but this would cost me so now i have 38 40 44 horsepower 51 then it's 22,000 bucks but it's still very very cheap and nice hmm yeah maybe later I will regret it to spend quite some money on a tractor I don't need so much. Okay, I have the three-point linkage and a small front attacher. Do I need a front loader? I don't know yet. Maybe I could add this later. But I need the three-point in the back and at least this small one in the front. And 50 horsepowers is something to to count on, so you can work with this. And isn't it cute? I th 
think I buy it. And even if I regret the cost of it, maybe the joy of having it will be enough for um, make me happy again. <laughs> but maybe I won't even regret it. So, and now I need a water tank. And I think that will be a, um, an important thing for, for my work, for the gardens that I'm planning. Here, this looks cheap and huge. And you can transport water and milk and all kinds of other stuff. Most of this are stinking, but yeah, for milk and water, this would be nice, I'd say. Yeah, and I know it's really sad that those centerpieces, the hubs of the wheels, that they don't change the color. I will do my best to change this. But I don't know whether I can accomplish it. I will try. So I just keep it like that. And the design color... Oh no, I don't change it. I already spent too much. But this is quite cheap for the size. So... Yeah, I would say we see each other at the dealership and and then I bring home this water tank and then we can fill up the gardens. Here I am. Yeah. With my latest useful trailer that I really need and my yeah, my, I don't know how to call it, in German we would call it pleasure board, something like that, <laughs> that I, I bought for my own pleasure, because the tractor is not really needed at the moment maybe tomorrow already needed and then I will be very happy to have it but today I would only need one tractor to be honest but I want to have this so this is somehow to treat myself. And I'm sure it will be very useful on the farm. For most of the feeding purposes and such, and delivering water to the gardens and such and so forth. Let's be honest, isn't it wonderful? I love this tractor so much. It looks so, so very much old-fashioned. And it still has enough power to be really useful. I pretty much love all those very, very old tractors. But this is, in my opinion, one of the most useful ones due to its horsepowers. And it's not fast. How 
However, you can enjoy the landscape while driving. Okay, this works with other tractors as well. But here you have more time to to enjoy the landscape. And you can smell the smell of your tractor <laughs> and not of the nature because I think it, it will have quite a strong smell if you look at the this black cloud it's not a cloud that is coming out of it but you know what I mean so now we will see Ooh. come on come on you can do it you can do it yes Discovered. So in the back it is very hilly, but here it is not so hilly, and in this direction it is rather flat, only very soft rolling hills. So it would be a good idea to expand in this direction with new fields and such. So now I will see no, this is not working. Maybe I should drive this away. Maybe I can just drive into the garden, get the water here and um, deliver the water there. Maybe I just try this. So I have to drive a circle. Maybe even from the back or backward. See whether it works. Maybe I could do this with the straw as well. So first I'm filling up. No, it don't want to fill up. Hmm. Let's see. Does 
doesn't want to fill up, but it should be possible to fill up. Maybe this is just for specialists. Hmm. Or maybe I go there the other way around? Very, very strange. I, I wonder what they thought about this. What they thought how it could work. Maybe the other idea was better to go through the the hedge. So I want I want to try to go there where you see this water droplet. Yeah, I'm not so good at navigating in narrow spaces, and then I always get stuck at the well. So, but now this should work. It doesn't. Okay. Why doesn't it work? Okay. Now, I try a different solution. Like so. And I hope this works because it maybe overlaps with the other well. But as oh, oh. As the other well isn't working, here now I can start filling. Okay. <laughs> mm. Yeah. This is the garden pump from my own mod, from my own garden mod. But I really wonder why this wonderful well is not doing what it should do. It's so cute and so nicely decorated. Oh, and I can already... Oh, look, look! The garden started growing already. I started delivering the water. Oh, this is nice. And look how the melons look. They are really nicely done. Yeah, they really look like melons. So... Did I fill it all up? Yes, I filled it all up. 
So then I can leave and I think this problem is solved. I just have to... Next time I can go there um, backward because it's easier to fill up. Yeah, and maybe I go for only melons or melons and red uh, lettuce. But first I enjoy the view of all those garden plants. Okay. Yeah, that's it for this episode. Oh, this has been a long one. <laughs> I wish you a wonderful day. Thank you for watching and all the best. Till next time. Tschüss.